Graham Potter wants Moses Caicedo at Chelsea. Chelsea manager Graham Potter would like to bring Moses Caicedo to Chelsea. Chelsea are considering a move for Caicedo in the January transfer window. Graham Potter was the man that brought Moses Caicedo to the Premier League in February 2021 for £4.75 million, and he may now be the man who brings him to Chelsea for a fee of around £75 million. There is major interest in Caicedo from Chelsea and a bid is thought to be going in within the next few days. Caicedo is the main midfield target for Chelsea in January after they missed out on Enzo Fernandez. Brighton would be willing to negotiate reluctantly if their asking price was met. According to Simon Phillips, Graham Potter would love to bring Moses Caicedo to Chelsea. It's something that is definitely possible in January and Potter knows exactly how to get the best out of Caicedo. The profile of Caicedo is something that interests Chelsea. The amount of positions within the middle of the park he can play to a good level is something the club value internally. Interest in Caicedo from Chelsea is concrete and there is a massive feeling that a bid will be launched before the end of the window. Brighton maintain nothing has been bid yet but they understand if there is before the window shuts. The feeling is that Caicedo would be open to a move away from Brighton, and due to the recruitment policy at Brighton they would be very unlikely to force him to stay if their asking price was met. Caicedo's future is in the balance and it's up to Chelsea now to decide whether to make a formal move for him. Newcastle United interested in signing Conor Gallagher. Newcastle United are interested in signing Chelsea midfielder Conor Gallagher in the January transfer window. Newcastle United are looking to strengthen in January to help their push for the top four in the second half of the season, and they have been identifying some players they believe can help push them to that next level. Conor Gallagher has been in and out of the Chelsea team this season and hasn't perhaps played as big a role as he may have liked when he chose to stay at the club in the summer. Newcastle are interested in the midfielder, and could offer him a chance to move this month. According to Luke Edwards of The Telegraph, Newcastle United are interested in Conor Gallagher and would like to take him on loan this month until the end of the season. The loan would likely contain an option to buy with Chelsea said to be looking for around £40 million to sell the player. Gallagher is thought to be open to a move due to a lack of game time at Chelsea. Chelsea potentially signing Moses Caicedo this month means Gallagher may get even less playing time than he currently has, and a loan until the summer would allow him to get game time and assess his options. Newcastle are not the only club interested with Crystal Palace thought to be intrigued by the idea of taking Gallagher back on loan. The midfielder has chances to leave in January and it's certainly something that could develop over the next few days. Jorginho is likely to leave Chelsea in the summer. Jorginho is likely to be allowed to leave Chelsea in the summer when his contract expires. There is not expected to be a new deal signed. There has been an expectation around Chelsea for some time that Jorginho would not be renewing his current deal beyond the summer and would be moving on as a free agent, that now looks to be the case. Chelsea are yet to find a breakthrough in negotiations with Jorginho and his representatives and there is still a disagreement on the terms of the deal. Jorginho is now expected to leave as a free agent in June and does have clubs interested in taking him when that happens. According to Nizar Kinsella, Jorginho is likely to leave Chelsea in the summer as a free agent and does not lack suitors from some top clubs. Barcelona are interested in the Italian midfielder as they continue to shop in the free agent market and Napoli are also showing interest in the Chelsea man. It's unlikely that Chelsea will try and cash in on the player in January but not out of the question if a suitable offer comes in. There has been no concrete offers as of yet. Out of Nagolo Kante and Jorginho it was always felt that Kante was the more likely of the two to commit his future to the club and that is proving to be the case now. Jorginho will leave in June unless there is any sudden breakthrough in negotiations, and Chelsea are looking to sign more than one midfielder in the coming months. Arsenal favourites for Declan Rice amid Chelsea interest. Arsenal have became favourites in the race for Declan Rice in the last couple of weeks. The West Ham midfielder looks increasingly likely to join the Gunners over Chelsea in January. It would have been a blow for Arsenal to lose out on Mikhailo Mudrik to Chelsea in the manner that they did last week, but they could return the favour in the summer when it comes to Declan Rice. For a long time it seemed certain that Rice would play his football at Stamford Bridge in the summer when he left West Ham, but that does not seem to be as likely now. Arsenal have moved into the lead and are expected to land Rice in the summer. According to Nizar Kinsella, Arsenal have moved into the lead in the race to sign Declan Rice in the summer. Rice is now much more likely to join Arsenal than Chelsea. 
Rice has been a priority for Chelsea for some time but the fact the Blues may miss out on Champions League football could be a factor playing in the mind of the West Ham midfielder. There is no chances for Rice to leave in January as West Ham will not allow it, but they are resigned to losing him in the summer. The fee reported is around £80 million. Chelsea have their focus on Moses Caicedo this window and will launch a bid for the midfielder in the coming days if they feel they can afford it financially. The stance could change between now and the summer, but as things stand Arsenal are favourites to sign Declan Rice this summer.